Welcome, I'm Loic Bruni. We're gonna take a look at my, my gear brakes. This is custom your brake. So I'm gonna show you what's customizable and what I like about my brakes. And just for your information, it's really important that you choose a brake that feels right. And I'm gonna tell you why mine feels right because the touch is really powerful on and off. There's no spongy feeling. It's, I really like the boom, the power and the aggressivity of it. And I'm gonna show you what, how I made mine. So this is my bike and this is my lever. So take a look. This lever here was made ages ago, uh, 3G printed titanium. It's now production and it comes with a different piece here. I don't know the name of this little light gray piece but it's really it's a little bit different than the other ones and then the way it pushes in the brake it's not so clean but doesn't matter the way it pushes in gives it a little bit more power and a little a little bit more bite to the brake and the way the brake feel is it's a little bit straighter here so it's a little bit more raw I would say more pure and this part here is a little bit thicker, so for big hands, it's a little bit nicer. And the touch is just unreal on these brakes. I really like it. Some people might think it's not appropriate, but for me, it's uh, the perfect fit. The ergonomy is perfect. To customize it, then you can change this piece with my levers or my skills or whatever. There's uh, three or four different types. You can change this piece here. I have the fluo yellow. A Magura color MT7 thing and this part here you can change the color too but mine's black pretty sober let's talk a little bit now about the calipers <laughs> um, this piece here look at this beauty four pistons four braking pads I don't know exactly which one I have but they are the gray ones the power and the touch of, of it on the rotor is really good it bites it like like that. I don't know exactly how it does it, but it's really good. I don't know. Honestly, you should try. And um, so this is beautiful. It's one of the most cool I've, I've ever seen. And the power of these things is not real. So the good thing about it is that even when the heat goes up, they stay relatively stable. And the touch is the same on the levers. And the power here doesn't change. And the contact braking pads rotor is the same so this is a big looks i wanted to have on my brakes and that magura was able to give me so this is good and customizing wise you can change these little pieces here this is gold to match this gold here specialized logo and you can change this color here the caliper color to black this is gray and you can also have it fluo yellow the classic magura and this is my rotor, by the way. Uh, I think it's called the HC. So I don't know exactly which one it is, but it's 203 millimeters. Perfect for downhill. There is also 220, but the power is really good already with this and more than enough. So I chose to run the 203 millimeters. Maybe on an e-bike you want a 220 because the weight of the bike and I've never really tried but I think it will make sense but so far I'm happy with that and yeah this is uh, my bike this was my brakes and the weight of one brake is 255 which is pretty light uh, it looks pretty massive and powerful and pretty moto but it's actually pretty light, so I'm pretty happy to have uh, to have that on this bike. Um, I think that's it. You know what uh, you should uh, use to know. <laughs> so that's it, fellas. This was my little break presentation for you, so you can choose exactly what you want. I'm stoked with Magura. The first time, actually, I tried the brakes before I chose to ride Magura. I on the shuttle on the way up I was hanging behind the car with a rope so the car was putting me up 
and I was breaking the whole way for five minutes on the road and to test, to test, because you want to test the brakes, yeah, you want to see the heat. So I did that, I got to the top, the, the rotors were blue, smoking, everything was really smelly bad. But the brakes on the way down during the run, they were unreal. Like they were working so well. I have never, I would have never expected that. And this is when I realized that I really wanted to ride with them, for them. And since then I'm stoked, so this was a little funny story that I really wanted to blow up the brakes, but they didn't. So, Deutsch Qualität, ein guter Job. Ah, sie reden, sie reden, sie reden.